Jason, coming in, DragRadioMedia.com with the Bruner Brothers. Quite possibly the Long Haul Award this weekend going to these studs over here. I tell you what, guys, and you can tell too, I'm, I'm a fat guy and I sweat all the time. But we're at Holly Springs Motorsports Park, and it's not March, is it, guys? Uh -huh. It is brutal. Talking about 80 degree temperature, uh, you know, the quote was where records will be reset or broken. I'm not seeing it happen. I think that we'll probably get the track pulled around. Java does a phenomenal job, but uh, you mentioned a little bit about a week ago, you guys had ran a little bit of the heat. This spring has been extremely wet and cool. Yep. You talk about going from an extreme to the other. You guys are running in 70s, it's getting down in the 50s at night, and now we're pushing 85 degrees and 130 degree track temp. A lot of, a lot of changes are gonna have to happen, usually in about a three week time span, isn't it? Oh, yeah. It's quick, a lot of chassis adjustments, a lot of shock adjustments, a lot of converter adjustments, you know, the whole, the whole car, you know, right. tempo, tuning, everything. We were talking about that, you guys come down to the North Star, had a little bit of problems going into last fall, man, halfway through that event, you got your swagger back, the mojo is there. Without letting them do about the bag, what did you guys find out there? Because you guys did a complete turnaround and, and have been going in the right direction ever since. No, we did some tuning things. You know, we, we changed some stuff around. We changed, you know, the whole motor around last season. We changed everything in the whole car. Right. And it just took a little while to find where it was happy spot. So one of those deals when you like you make a lot of changes, we're all there, we're like, it's gonna be fine. Yeah. And then you fired up and you're you know, four steps behind where you were and you're scratching your head going, Well, all the changes we made we should have come right back in at the level, but it is amazing. You know, we, we talked to a lot of racers and stuff, and, and I'll let this car go by. We have a lot of racers that come out, and I said, I, I don't want to sound brutal, I said, but when you're at the end of the track and the rods are hanging into the bag, you know the problem. Mm -hmm. It's when the car fires, the compression's right, the fuel's right, the converter's right, the electronics, everything's telling you, yep. you know, that it's perfect, and the old girl's just not doing what it is that'll drive a guy crazy. Oh, exactly. And you're so used to, you know, being near the top and you come out and struggle with it. Exactly. Hard. And you hit it on the head. You guys have been leading the X for, for such a long time. You make some changes, knowing that other teams have been making mm -hmm. some serious changes going into fall. You come back, you stumble a little bit. It's not like you just showed up. You guys are a marquee oh. team. And which is, the crazy part is, you've got three times the pressure on you. Oh, yeah. You know, and then not only are you beating yourself up, then racing community, everybody's family, but it don't matter. You kick family no matter what. But, you know, you start having, and then, well, I have a lot of buddies that will do stuff like that, and they're friends. You, you have nine solutions. You'll have ten guys come by. They'll have nine solutions to fix your problem. <laughs> then you get about the second or third deal, and you're starting to think, well... Man, by messing something, yeah, yeah, you start second guessing yourself exactly. So, but like I said, you guys got it back together. You've been knocking on the door, had a few mishaps, you know, to keep from the money so far. Mm -hmm. But the team has definitely turned the corner, going in the right direction. Yeah, no, we're happy where we're at now. You know, everything's working a lot better. Cars working really good. You know, we just, I missed it a couple times at the end of the track. The track's going away, or it's, you know, right. we ran a couple like you know water. You right. know, people with cars, we ran until that next time, and you can't see on top end. Exactly. Yeah, but, what it is with it. You know, those are hard losses, but they're not nearly as hard as when you mess the tune up or, you know what I mean, when you do something yourself. Yep. You know, it's it's brutal no matter what. At the end of the night, you want to be in the winter circle, and it, oh, yeah. it makes the ride home a lot easier. But the little stuff, and, and I call it the little trivial stuff, and it is, to me, that drives me up the wall yep. more than anything major. Oh, so. yeah. As long as the car goes back to the trail and the driver's in one piece, it's a win. Everything's good. Yeah. Paint's good on both sides. Everybody's yep. happy. That's so. good. All right, well, I'm going to head back to Jason, DragRadioMedia.com. We're at Holly Springs, Mississippi. The Brewer Brothers are here in the house, guys. When they're here, all bets are off. Anything can happen. So back to you, Jason. Thank you, guys.